Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to the Nine Miles Review of the As Seen On TV Tater Mitts Quick Peeling Potato Gloves. And these are gloves that help you uh, peel potatoes. So it's fast and easy. This is the description. Waterproof and comfortable. Peels the thinnest layer of potato skin. No more nicks and cuts. And they get low ratings actually on Amazon. 2.5 out of 5 stars with 37 customer reviews. The price on these is $8.99 with free shipping. And so I'm excited to try them out, see if they actually work. It's a very interesting product. Probably one that I won't use because I just use a potato brush and I think that works fine. And having a glove, you know, storing gloves, I think is actually more difficult than just storing a brush. So it comes with this little uh, card. Tater mitts instructions. Do not use tater mitts in any way not consistent with the instruction. Tater mitts are not intended for use as hot mitts. They do not use or don't use them in the oven. Don't have them come in contact with high temperatures. Uh, to use, place the desired amount of potatoes in a pot. Cover with cold water. Uh, bring water to a boil with stove burner on high. Let the potatoes boil for approximately five to six minutes. Remove the potatoes from the stove. Drain water. Pick up potato wearing tater mitts and rub vigorously under cold water to remove the skin. You place the colander underneath for easy cleanup. The special surface of the tater mitts allows you to peel, peel the potato with minimum effort and maximum results. So I, actually I thought these were these gloves were for uh, cleaning the potatoes and it's actually for uh, taking off and, and then the, you know cleaning the potatoes and uh, taking them off the skin off before you actually cook them but nope just read the instructions and it's actually for uh, taking off the skin after cooking so that makes a lot more sense I was kind of like how, how are these going to remove the skin but just something I've noticed is uh, you're cleaning potatoes possibly over a pot so there is a possibility of these little chunks of rubber um, this is just kind of what I'm thinking uh, getting into your potatoes which I don't think it would be that appetizing. So, just something to consider. But yeah, the gloves fit well. I wouldn't say they're low quality. If they feel very substantial, thick. And uh, let me just rub these together, see if I can get these. Yeah, so I rubbed the gloves together and that little piece fell off. So, um, I think when you're cleaning the potatoes, you want to make sure you're doing it over the sink so you can catch these little things not in your pot. Of, uh, you know potatoes all right so let's test them out see if they work excited to try them out it's the as seen on TV tater mitts all right so the potatoes are done and I'm gonna put on the gloves see if this actually works so the pots overflowing because I put some cold water in it so I could actually lift up the potatoes here are the potatoes. I'm going to start rubbing them. <laughs> and look at that. It's taking off the skin. <laughs> but it's also making a mess. And it's making such a mess that I think I'm only going to do one potato. Alright, so there we go. Now you can see the gloves covered in this potato goop. So you have to wash these if you're using uh, the tater mitts. Um, so yeah, but I'll, sh I'll show you the potato. That's what it looks like. It did take off the skin. Um, kind of made this texturized, a weird texture, but, you know, just kind of a rough texture. It's kind of the same texture as the gloves, so the gloves did that to the potato. So, uh, do I recommend the tater mitts? Just based on that, I would say no. I don't, I really, it's just kind of unappetizing the way this takes off the skin. Uh, you see the gloves now, now you're going to have to clean them. It makes a big mess. Uh, the potential of this stuff falling into your potato, uh, you know, pot 
that's a, a possibility. So for that reason, I don't recommend the, the tater mitts. I think if you want to try them out, go for it because they do do what they say. I just don't think they work well enough. Uh, you know, just get a peeler. I think there's better options. And uh, so I don't recommend the tater mitts. Thanks for watching my videos. If you like them, please subscribe. I and mean, if you want to support them, you can go to patreon.com slash nine malls. All right, thanks for watching.